Okay, we got another special guest here. That's that's the benefit of being down here in Florida is, you know, a lot of bodybuilders are located down here as well as a lot of travel here. So this one's a really special one to me because I've been talking to him for a while, but this is yours, um, known as Miracle Bear, more to most people on Instagram. So like I said, you guys have heard me talk about this guy, especially in the classic, divis classic physique division that I think you know the next person. The oh, nah, I've even said it's Chris. I think if anyone's going to take you out, it's going to be it's going to be him right here. So I'm really excited for his future. Young, thriving, doing it the right way. Um, you know, making his rounds right now. He's just just a perfect perfect fit overall, man. You're just doing it right. Uh, and you know, he trains like a like a bad motherfucker. So <laughs> you know, that's what we want to do today. I've, yeah. I've heard yet. Heard he trains hard. So we're going to do a back session today. Um, tell us a little bit. How how's your trip been so far? Trip was great. First of all, thanks for the awesome introduction. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we decided to go to Florida like spontaneously. I said, you know what? Fuck it. We need something. Sometimes on prep you need something different, you know. Yeah. And then I said, I will have, my anxiety was kicking, and I'm like, I oh, know I'm leaving home. And I want to stay in my bunker and train there. But then I said, fuck it. Let's let's try something different. And then we said, let's go to Florida. First fall to Tampa. Um, yeah, we met high profile coach Terence, uh, Nick Walker for training, and then uh, yeah, we moved on, come from here down to the Revive headquarters and uh, train with the big boys and, over here. And so, finishing it off with me, and then you head out tomorrow, right? Yeah, and then uh, flying back tomorrow, yeah. tomorrow morning. So flying back to Germany, then he's got about another probably six weeks back in Germany, then you're gonna come out here to you're gonna go out to Vegas. To so Vegas, right? yeah. yeah. So, like I said, to make sure you're checking him out. Um, if you do, I'm sure you all know who he is already, but you know, bright, bright future, and I'm really excited for the Olympia. This is when he makes that next step. And this boy needs the qualification. <laughs> and we're gonna give you qualification. So he I'm gonna, gonna he gonna invade Europe because he's also <laughs> he, he's a blast backstage too. So I gotta make sure I'm at the level. <laughs> You're like a high intensity yeah. and a high volume guy. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. So yeah. So I mean. And you, you'll see a lot. A lot of it's kind of like what you probably did with Nick earlier this week too. Yeah, like a lot of high intensity, and especially with like working up to a top two set. Yeah, so like you like do that one all out set, hundred ten percent. Maybe get a little bit of partner failure on it. You know, or partner assistance. I mean, pass failure, um, and then usually some kind of nasty back off where it's either time under tension, you know, rest pause, drop set. Um, uh, you know, just slowing things down at the end after you already pushed through. But yeah. as you see, we, we go heavy and we go hard, man. Yeah. It's not no, not no fluff stuff. I know people like to change shit, you know, especially in prep. It's like, yeah, I'm going high rep the rest of the way, and that's like, you know, is, if you're lifting, you know, if you're creating that stimulus through the weight and then just pushing yourself with the yeah. intensity, it's gonna do it. High reps, you're only creating more fatigue. Yeah. Oh, yes. Now we go. Come on, though. Come on. Yep. Here we go, here we go. Sam. Two, two, two. Perfect. Right there. Yep. This is it, this is it. Drive. Good shot. Yeah. Woo. Yep. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Here we go, let's go. You're in it, you're in it. Stay, stay the fuck in there. Stay the fuck in there. We got two. We got two. One more. One more. Okay. Hell yeah. yeah. Push it. Yeah. You got more. Come on, Brett. Yes. Let's go. Stay in it. Pull. Easy. Push. Two more. Come on, two more. Squeeze. Up one. Easy. All the way. Come on. Hard. Yes, sir. Ooh. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yeah. Two lower left. Come on. Think about the bed. You open it up. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. No, no, come on, push. You got more. Come on, easy. Let's go. Hello, come on. Now we can. Let's go. Two more, two more. Squeeze. Last one. Hard. Come on, push it. 
Yep. Yes, sir. Yeah, good. So yeah, like you said, we want to do more isolation stuff today. So I wanted to show them this one, obviously. We've done some kind of variation, but I love this setup here. You guys have seen it before. But just a single line, single arm, driving with the, working on the low lat. So we went up to the top set there, just 10 to 12 all out. Now we're gonna lighten it up and focus on a little bit more squeeze for one to two seconds, a slower stretch out of the hole. So a lot of detail today, a lot of touch-ups since it's both of our second back days. But like I said, this is a uh, detail work for both of us right now. Yeah. Butcher hooks are uh, Miracle Bear approved, so yeah. I knew you were going with the red socks, white yeah. red, so I had to go. <laughs> Do you have different tunnels? Oh uh, yeah, so they'll be like, I'll, I'll do different drops but too. But the, the real one is the, the, the reds red, are really the red. We got some camo. Yeah. We got some pink for the girls. Some shit. All for the boys. We'll do a we'll do a collab down the road. Just put, put yeah. Add a little bear emoji all over. <laughs> nice. Special bear edition. Let's do this. Okay, when I open up the last little bit more, work on those fronts. Um, you know I love my pullovers, so we're doing pullovers here. Do my favorite grip, I call this the butterfly grip, because it's kind of like shaped like a butterfly, but it's the mag grip that opens up wide. Um, to explain the earth here, how that works is, it's so good that, you know, for this, it's because it forces your elbows to stay open. So with the grip, you already put yourself in the position. So you don't need to move it all here. Just set yourself, set your lats, engage them, and then just this movement using your lats. So, when you can get a piece of equipment like this, like this mag grip that does it, all the positioning for you, and then you just gotta worry about rep execution and keeping it in there. So keep it in the loaded muscle and just go yeah. to the very, very end. So you can't do any no more. It was different, eh? You like the grip one? Yeah. I said, I said to my guy here, I try start to implement this in my my back routine as well. Oh, feel it. Bless you. Oh. Three pulses, one more. Yeah. One, two, three. Good. Yep. One, two, three. All the way. Come on. It's right now. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Easy. Stay in. Finish, bro. Let's go. Yeah. Come on, finish. Easy. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I felt good. That's the first time I tried this partials right on the bottom. That felt really good. Right there. Right there. There it is. The big stretch. Let it go, let it go, let it go. Bam. 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 <laughs> Big stretch. Right there. Right there. Here we go. Stretch. There you go. One more round. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Let go. Full ones now. Full ones. Feel the stretch each time. Feel the stretch. Yep. Stretch. Come yes, on, keep working. Let's is, go. Here it is. Uh, now you work. Let's go. Big one. Big one. Big one. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Good. Stretched. Stretched the whole left. That's how it's done. Good. Good. We are wide. I feel like birds. <laughs> we got wings. <laughs> We're gonna fly across the ocean tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> right to Europe. <laughs> right to Europe. <laughs> so this we're focused on, we wanna move on to an upper back movement. So, so elbows are high. So we're keeping it in line with our upper back. Our butt is back because that's forcing our chest into the pad. So he falls into the pad, so he can't cheat and lean back. So he's driving through his upper back and with his chest into the pad. So only thing I can pull are those traps, those rhomboids, you know, upper, middle, low traps, rhomboids, rear delts a little bit too on top, but just building that thickness up, up at the top. So 
Something we both need. Come on. Come on. It's easy work. Mm. Few more weeks. Show them who you are. Come on. Let's go. One. Come on. Three. Four. Five. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Four. Easy. That's it. Come on. Yeah. Two more. Two more. Come on. One more. Last one. That's it. There was a car block there. <laughs> Five more. One, two, come on. Bang it on. Yeah. Two more, two more. Last one. Good. Good. That's good. Big combo. So, yeah, we were doing a th we did a three plate drop set there at the end. So, we went three plates to two plates. And on the last plate, we moved it down to the end range. So, on this prime machine, you see you can go different ranges of the movement. So we were mainly focused on the back squeeze there. So at the very, very end, we were completely tired. We put all the, we put it on the end range, so it was hardest at the top. Even though it was lightweight, we still had to battle through and squeeze at the end. So just small little fucking tips like that, you know, we're, we're for, like you just explained, we're so fortunate here to have all this different equipment. When you can use things like this, it has different right. modes, different ranges, yeah, um, different efforts. Like, yeah. Yeah, you gotta take advantage of it. So that's what we're gonna do today. Let's go. Good, squeeze back in. Beautiful. In your zone. Come on. Give me five. Four. Three big. Two squeeze. One squeeze. Here we go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. This is when it hurts. Make it hurt. Let's go, make it hurt. Come on. Three. Two. Yes. All right, buddy. Slow in the beginning, squeeze hard. Slow pull, finish hard. There, every inch. Every inch. Each rep is growth. Right there. Let's go. All right, here we go. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Too big. Finish. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> That's how it works. So I've been over T-Bar Rows here. He picked it, I'm glad he did. I wasn't gonna pick it with legs tomorrow, but um, we're just busting out. It's good. It's probably run into the, doing the heavy hardship pass. So. That's how we roll. Here we go.
Good. Let me run. Let me run. Three, two, one. Oh. Translation, thank God for the butcher hooks. <laughs> Easy, bro. Come on. You want to win? Show them how better you look. Let's go. Fuck yeah. Come on. Go. Easy. Last set. Yeah. One, two, three. Come on. Go. Let's go. Easy. Come on. Fuck it. Come on. Two more. Last one. Squeeze. Come on. Yeah. Come. On. Easy. Now pump it. Pump it. Come on. Five. Four. Three. Two. Come on. It's perfect. Oh, last weeks I trained with, with, with Marcus Rule sometimes. Yeah. And he never could do a pull up. Oh, I just didn't even fall alive. He was like. You go your whole entire body weight career without he me. He was 350 <laughs> in the off season, so fuck it. <laughs> Bro, he couldn't even wipe his own ass. <laughs> There's no way. He's still so big and he's so over Is he? I was wondering. Fuck. We're gonna do some assisted pull ups. I've been loving this. I've been finishing all my back workouts with this assisted pull up machine. Really focus on creating a chest lift, elbows forward so you're loading your lats, and then finish them through and squeeze at the top. So, elbows forward. We're not staying back and pulling to our chin like a lot of people do on pull downs. We're using the lats that are intended to be worked here. So, make sure you're watching how we're doing this and finish your workout with these. These are awesome because it helps with the stretch as well. Just finishes you up perfect. <laughs> Good. I swear there was a day when I used to just sit here and do like 30 of these. Yeah? But no way. Back in the classic day. <laughs> Back in the classic day. I can do that. Last one, last one. Yeah. Yes. Good job, bro. Hell yeah. Thank you. Good job. Yes, sir. We got it. I appreciate you coming through, man. You do have a home here now if you need it. Yeah, thank you. We, we've opened the invitation. Definitely. You're down here in South Florida. Definitely not the last training with the boxer. No. I love his style of training. He goes all in, no joke, joking around beside the training, but if we are inside, tunnel vision, focus on the goal. And yeah, a few more weeks to go, and it's time to- Well, hopefully we'll both be in Vegas, and I'll sure. go out there early too. I mean, it's just, yeah. This man's gonna see a lot of him in the future. Um, it's only time until he's at the top, and Same to you. I'm glad that like I've been able to kind of see him from the start and watch his journey unfold, man. He's a, He's one of the good ones out here. So make sure you're following his, especially his YouTube. Is it just Miracle Bear? Is it Earth? Uh, Earth, Earth Kalashinsky. Yeah, stuff. so pay attention to what he's doing. He's, he's doing all the right things. Thank you. Shaking all the right hands, making himself visual. Everybody's got a, a yeah, beautiful face thing. with the name now. And we have to motivate each other. You we know? gotta motivate each other. Back in the days, everybody trained together. I don't know if uh, all the guys. Yeah, it's called Jim. And now I think here in Florida, especially South Florida, is the new. Mecca, yeah, Mecca is of bodybuilding. That's why we're down here to get better. And so. uh, yeah, I just wanted to take this opportunity, come down and get some good training session, yeah. get some new motivation or you know, new motivation, but more, even more motivation for the upcoming Olympia this year. And uh, yeah, we only can improve. So let's fucking go. And uh, thank you for having fun, guys. Yeah.